so... Oh, no, like this. Yeah, it gotta be my plan. Blonde, German... That must be one of these silencers. I hope it works. I feel like I'm gonna be waste of bullets, but um Ich fühle mich heute nicht so gut. Ich habe wirklich Heimweh. actually do up here? Is it worth wasting one of his bullets? I don't think so. But we're still gonna have to go through here though. Maybe that's what we got. Two bullets. I didn't expect that. Hey, princess, up here. Are you okay? Yes, I am. Did they do anything to you? They're all looking they at the didn't door. get a chance. Oh, that's good to hear. I was worried as hell. Hmm. So you took your armor and a horse and went under the princess's tower? That's right. Leonard, I really appreciate it. But let's be professionals here, okay? Okay, you're right. That must be one of these silencers. I hope it works. Sweet revenge. Hmm, hold on. And then we have actually this guy walking back and forth. moment he gets out of hearing range Boom. see you in hell sweet revenge and here he is open <laughs> Hold 
see you in hell. Fuck him. So, Sweet revenge. How did he hear that? I think I'm still gonna have to kill those two, but I don't know say saving, probably I don't save. Um How did they hear that? Or, and even, you know, like, see? Okay, um, how the fuck? Sweet no, really, how the fuck? interesting and now we are at that <sighs> yes I should probably hide them Okay, so how do we get to this guy then? What's this? Hmm. Cutting the lights out, eh? I think you are. I trust you are. How did you get captured? Better still, how the hell do I get in? Here. Wake up! 
I'm here to get you out. The AK sent me. Okay, sorry. Ah, sorry. I've had a bit of a hard time. To be honest, I don't even know how long I've been here. You can still walk, right? So get your ass up and let's go, soldier boy. I, I, look, I need to get my gear back. They must be keeping it in the same building. What gear? Uh, my SS uniform, among other things. It'll help us getting out. Okay. Let's move. Oh, I also need my SS uniform, by the way. They have fuses in this room on the left. We can go darker if we mess with them a little. Good idea. I don't think I actually need to do this, but, you know, just for fun. How did you get captured, though? sent a woman to bust me out. Oh, okay. 
think that it'll work. Fuck it then. Uh, I did not hear him actually get uh, upset about anything, so, you know, what the hell. That should have worked. Maybe if I had stood here, actually, I might have been able to do it better. Does it actually do us some anything, you know? Does it actually do anything?
No, or for fuck's sake. Conduct an interrogation. Okay, hold on. Let me read this. <laughs> There's a threat in the guy, guy or girl that they're gonna be hanged. Truth and their agreement to cooperate and must be promised freedom and material independence, which of course they will never receive. Obviously, if the interrogated person still does not want to cooperate, the most sophisticated methods must be used. A special room is used for this purpose. I guess it's down where we shot the officer. The interrogation space are prepared or be pre prepared ropes hanging from the ceiling to which you need to tie the hands of the prisoner twist it behind the back and pull it up vertically oh yeah 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 that hurts as fuck you you go too far up in that and your fucking shoulders are gonna say bye like we're gonna crack open no we're gonna crack if I understand this correctly. Tied and twisted behind her back and pulled up vertically. Yeah, yeah. And that's how you conduct an, uh, an interrogation in uh, Germany. 1943 and probably a little bit more. Shoot him! For fuck's sake! Shoot him! Okay, so who actually arrives if, uh, if I do this? I've been lipsing like fucking hell lately. Holy shit, I hate it. So much. And he's like, huh? Okay, so that takes one away and now he's coming. Another way, I suppose. 
what's gonna. dogs. The uniform may not deceive them. Mm, not really an SS uniform I remember it to be, but... They sent a woman to bust me out. You got a problem with that? No, it's just, you know, we don't use German women to fight. Oh, I see. Your women are only good to cook and take care of Aryan children. And you know what? I'd gladly live like them. But you damn fascists and Bolsheviks invaded us, you know? Yeah, but 
Yeah, but all our lives were broken to pieces thanks to you. So don't you ever tell shit about women's roles to me, okay? You know, the more I get to know you, the more I can't imagine you as a housekeeper. What's your name? Just call me Greta. <laughs> Damn, I knew you reminded me of someone. Greta Garbo. Oh, congrats on your perceptiveness, Jerry. Name's Manfred, and I'm on your side. I bet. Your appearance makes me want to shoot you. Go ahead. I don't care about my life anymore. My task is to get you out of here, so forget it. How did you end up here, anyway? Long story. Just tell me the short version. I've been on the Eastern Front since 41. Back and forth. And we deserted. And by some total coincidence, we become part of AK operations. Who's we? Well, me and... I no longer call him a friend. He left me. Gave up on me. That's how I ended up here. I see. But this no longer a friend of yours joined AK along with you? Yes. A Lithuanian named Lucas kind of drafted us in. It seems like I became expendable. Seems like you didn't. All in all, they've sent us to help you out. Us? Yes. You'll see. So something happened, and... Uh... Uh, Evald kind of skedaddled. So how do we get you out? No, really, how the hell do we get you out? He has to go all the way fucking back. No, actually not. I can fuck off this way. Alright. They doing Manfred and uh, Evald, Evald, whatever, for well, obviously a mission, but you know, something happened. I'm sure we're gonna hear all about it in the uh, next mission. You know, I actually need to deal with that. See me there. Uh uh. No, sir. No, sir. Carrots, potatoes, by the looks of it. Apples and apples, and something else.
He has to go all the way around. Almost. Actually, yeah, all the way around. That was too early. That was too early. That was my bad. Completely my bad. either. How do I get him down? How do I get him down? Unless there's a uh, jumping. No, nah, probably not. Wait, he can... Ah, yeah, he does have to go all the way around. I mean, uh, here. Should be easy enough. Apparently. This mission better not get any longer. See you in hell. We're closing to two hours. So, uh, yeah, so fixing my microphone a little bit, there we go. And I can't sneak by him, but I think... I think something else might be up. So we're gonna kill him. See you in hell. Pick him up instead. There and save. I don't think they can see each <laughs> see each other. And what about rubble then? Don't tell me we have to go all the way around. Don't bloody tell me that because that's gonna make me quite pissed. How the hell were you seen, boy? And I haven't saved. Oh no. Okay, yes I did. <laughs> How were you seen, lad? See you in hell. And lay down after you done what I asked you. Ah. That's why. That's why. He moved. He moved. Wait, hold on. I should probably check that out soon. I need a. I probably need a sniper around or something. Yeah. He's moving too fast for me to actually be able to do anything. A bit too fast. Yes, it was an officer, yes. I get this sense I should uh, clean up this area a little bit. Ooh. Mm, okay. 
habe ein Geräusch gehört. One down. Stand up. thing though with the uh, fighting though you don't get enough time to actually fight so to speak I mean, you, you don't get I said this many times but you don't get like this time to actually move your mouse over to another character tell him to help out one down so, uh, yeah. Ah, I see, I see. It would have been better if... Save. By the way, how can this be a special ability? Why is it a special ability? It's real stupid. Real stupid. Anyway, I can't get my microphone right. Or it's just me speaking very unloud or quiet. Anyway, come on, move, please. He's dead. Nothing to see here. Don't mind checking if anyone else is in there, like, yeah. Okay, so when I, they talk, we're just gonna have to bum rush the bushes. No, 
idea where we're gonna get out, but I think this might be be it. Although I doubt it. Now, oh my God, so how do we get out? Probably the truck. Probably. Yeah. Ah, I see, I see. The German boy is... Leaving all these bodies around, don't I? Or won't I? Down. There we go. Okay. So Greta, you can pick up this pistol. Okay, so you fall. Okay. Alright. Oh, the missions might actually be getting longer and longer, or I'm getting worse Breaking and in. worse. <laughs> en route. Fine, go. No, 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 Greta, Greta, where the fuck are you going? Shot you. Greta, who's this? He's our secondary objective. You speak German? A bit. Right, let's switch to German. What some Teufel biz do? Name's Manfred, and I'm with the AK. You are part of the AK? What, German killing Germans? You don't know the fuck about me. So maybe explain yourself, Jerry, before I shoot. Hey, shut up, you two. We need to find the way out. They don't bury the dead here. So they have to transport the bodies out somehow. Okay. Now that may be our chance. Let's get to the back gate then. Watch yourself, Fritz. My trigger is very sensitive. Fred, stop your damn babbling. We're in this together. Oh, as you wish, princess. Uh, how do we get there? We have to go through everybody, and don't we? Ah, yes, yes. Here. Actually, it might not be that hard. Use these two that. Hold on. The ladder is guarded, okay. an objective to actually help those two. I mean, we can't get down, so I guess not. Ugh. 
for fuck's sake. You Aha, uh -huh, okay. Go, go, go. And you won't even start the problem. Okay, I understand that though. I understand that, but if the door would have been open, I would have freaked that out a little bit. All these people. I wish I could come back here and bust them out with full force. Trust me, I'd have some matters to settle here, but that is not our job. <laughs> Seems like you saw nothing so far in this fucking war. I guess you're the lucky one, lady. You really trust a German? It's the commander's call to assess any new assets, not mine. Yeah, but I'm asking you. The Gestapo tortured him. That is sufficient evidence of his credibility for me. Yeah, or he is a double spy ordered to infiltrate our operations. To be honest, his eyes speak to me quite the contrary. I don't base my judgment on a woman's intuition. Oh, and I you. don't care. I have my orders. I'm watching you, Kraut. Yeah? And what do you see? A fucking SS Kraut. If you really need to know, I was in the Wehrmacht, not SS. Like I care, I'll never trust you. Maybe one day I'll explain the difference. I don't care. Kraut is a Kraut. I've learned not to lump people together. Maybe one day you'll get there. You can actually walk, so... Uh... Russom. All right. I hope I can burst in there and just... Everybody. Then what the hell are you doing I'll down there? Door. I don't sure. Care. I'm going down. I fucking saw that. Like, yep, here he is. I'll check that door. Fine, go. The thing is the Manfred can't actually... Unless I whistle one guy away... Hey there! Start with him, I think. I don't exist, sorry. That officer has to go. Unless I do this. Be fucking smart. Yeah, 
I think I whistle him away. I can actually do that, just get him away from there. And now it's that guy. I can't whistle him away as easily. No, I can't actually. No, I can't. Get under this rack and don't even breathe. I'm disguised, so I'm... Get out of the way, <laughs> Okay. That worked. I thought you would take care of that officer. What Led was literally saying, you know, I, you know, all the time when they met, they're like, oh, I love you, or something like that. But later on, it's like, but I don't give a shit about what you think. All right. Um, well, thank you all for watching. Hope you all enjoyed, and uh, see you all next time. I should explain how I ended up in Bialystok prison. Yes, please. We were halfway to the Kolmhof when we were stopped by a German patrol. Although the Home Army prepared us well for such an eventuality, we still had to be careful. It seemed like everything was going well, till Eval drew too much attention to himself. We started arguing, couldn't keep his cover story straight, and that's what made the soldiers suspicious. Then something happened that I didn't expect. They left me behind. I couldn't believe it. I was both angry and scared. I was sure I'd be killed there and then. Yet that was not the fate that awaited me. Instead, it was something far worse than death. The Gestapo, the German secret police, interrogated and tortured me. I lost track of time. The tools they used, the methods, monsters. They knew how to break a man. They would not let me die until I gave them what they wanted. What I told them, I had no choice. Oh no. Ew. 
Yet somehow, against all odds, I was given a chance to redeem myself. As for what happened next to Eivold, I didn't care about that. I was sure our paths would never cross again. So that's the street, yeah? Our safe house is the other side of the square at the end of it. We've just got word from the Vilnius cell that two days ago all of their commanders have been captured by the Soviets. My god. They're my people. That's why we arranged an emergency meeting of our cell. And by the way, we will talk about what can be done about releasing our friend, right? Exactly. There's one problem, though. Latest events here in the city brought hell of an SS reinforcements on us. Yeah, that checkpoint will be a problem. I fail at checkpoints, as we all know. If you get the pass papers, I could hide you in my truck here and try to pass through. And it's possible. Two days ago, our agents assassinated some higher-ranking SS maggots. Yeah, it looks like a huge funeral out there. Some of their officers will have pass papers for sure. Sneak into the graveyard, see what you can do. Okay, we can do this. Otherwise, we'll work out something else. Yeah, give us some time. Did you hear that? Vilnius fell to the Soviets. Along with your partisan friends. We're fucked, Evold. It will end up with Siberia for all of us. If you're lucky. Yeah. Half in the train, half in the ditch. The Allies allied with Stalin and they will never tell him to stop. Face it, we're alone. You'll see. The Soviets will be telling everyone they liberated us from the Germans. <laughs>